Have you ever wondered what makes a golf course so green? I'm on my way out to see Adam, our superintendent at Bearspot, and he's gonna teach us today about what types of fertilizers we use on a golf course. Track down Adam on the 14th hole. He's doing one more pass on this fairway. But if you actually look close down here with me, you can see this fertilizer and, and the different types of small pieces that will slowly get into the ground. And if you look close, they're actually different colors. Adam's gonna share with us why they're different and the different types of fertilizer components that are in this specific fertilizer. This is a, uh, an important blend of three elements that the plant needs for growth. Uh, the first being nitrogen, second phosphorus, third potassium. And this, this fertilizer is a blend of all three plus some micronutrients that the plant needs uh, for, for growth. The best way to think about it is the, the three letters, N, P, and K, yeah. is up, down, and all around. So the nitrogen being for plant growth and color, okay. and the phosphorus being for uh, root development, yeah. potassium for all around uh, plant strength and plant health. Right. And so you're fertilizing fairways today, uh, yeah. depending on the time of the year and you know the weather that's been for a golf season for us, you fertilize fairways once, twice, how many times typically in the golf season? What we're planning on this particular year is, is one application. Yeah. And the reason for that is this particular blend is 80% is slow release particles. Okay. So over time, they will, they will release the, the nutrients into the plant and that will carry us through till probably September. And then we'll assess at that time what needs more and what doesn't. Some areas of the golf course might need a little more at that time and some won't. Then the other way we fertilize is in liquid form. So we'll actually use um, uh, granulars like this, but it, it melts down into a liquid. Right. And we put that in our sprayer and, and spray it out on the fairway. So that's another way we can fertilize. Absolutely, and you do that sometimes more liquid fertilizers on greens, for example, right? Because you use a little bit of a different fertilizer exactly. there as well. Yeah. Exactly, so the greens get fertilized every two weeks with a liquid, liquid form. Yep and that's more of a quicker release. So we're not looking for longevity, we're looking for more of a spoon feeding of the greens. And that's how we keep the growth nice and consistent. Really important part of our process on keeping the turf healthy, green for the golfers. Hope you enjoyed learning a little bit about fertilizer. Adam, thanks for your time. Of course. If you're not subscribed to the channel, please do so. Of course, hit that notification bell, that like button. I'll see you next time.